Oh, turn that off. Hey folks, it's Grimwit from Natch Evil. Now look, uh, here's a couple of things. We're going to do this. Uh, I need to do a couple of things. Anyway, uh, I am going to play Euro Truck Simulator because I cannot figure out how to make PD Love May. So I need something to kind of, I don't know, fill the gap, as it were. Because I don't want to go a week without doing a video. Or more than more than a week without doing a video. Uh, any case, um, here's some things you need to know about these particular videos. One, I am rich and can do whatever the hell I want, uh, so I'm not really worried about it. I'm getting closer to buying my third garage, which will make me even richer. Uh, two, you don't have to watch this video if you don't want to. You can just, um, I don't know, like. Uh, Let's calm down, relax, put this in the background, and do whatever you want, like your homework, or work on your poems to PD, or whatever. Let's see, service, I need to repair some stuff. There we go. I'm not terribly worried about it. Like I said, I'm pretty rich with this game, so. Uh, let's see here, I believe what I need to do next is explore another area. Uh, in any case, so I'm going to talk to you a little bit about, I don't know, ooh, a ramp. Huh. Can I fit on that ramp? Hmm. Anyway, um, stuff, stuff is happening. I'm kind of pissed off about, uh, high school dreams. Oh yeah, I haven't finished what I was going to talk to you guys about. Hmm. Hmm, that's a problem. Yeah. Is it moving on its own? Huh. Anyway. Um, so the main thing, uh, is I just need to talk. Ooh, maybe I can pull forward now. Yeah, there we go. Alright. That worked out pretty well. Let's see what that did to my, uh, to my truck. Damage, 0%. I'm actually looking pretty good still. Awesome. Science, bitch. So, um, yeah. I uh, need to fill some time. I need to just kind of relax. This is a very casual Let's Play. That's how I play the game. I just kind of relax, you know, uh, zone out a little bit while I play. I set the uh, uh, red light, huh? Well, I am the player, which means I'm above the law. Oh, look at that. They know. Um, I don't know. I just, just want to relax a little bit and talk to you guys. Uh, let's see, what can I talk to you about? Well, I can talk to you about Best Friends Forever. This game is so unknown, and I'm kind of surprised. I'm seeing a lot of games, uh, a lot of Let's Plays about this game, but not a whole lot of... Get out of my way. Not a whole lot of strategy guides or anything. And that kind of that kind of bothers me a little bit. It also kind of excites me at the same time, because it means that I'm probably the first one coming across this problem. There we go. This problem with Petey, I mean. Uh, Petey just won't fucking love me. I don't know what's going on. I imagine it's a glitch. My biggest fear is that um, I just can't get the damn thing to work. Like, uh, I can't get Petey to, I into a win state and I have to start over. And of course, that brings about the whole fear that I might have to just give up on Petey. I don't want to give up on Petey. Nobody wants me to give up. Do you want me to give up on Petey? No. No, you don't. I, I cannot believe you want me to give up on Petey. What is wrong with you? God. We're going to go up to Dresden. I need to kind of fill out my map. Or I could go south to Brno. Bur Brno. Brno. What country is this? Still, still not sure what country this is. Germany? Germany? No, is it? Is that Austria? Because I thought Germany was over here. Hmm. 
Let's go set the burn now. Let's see here. We'll just get on this Route 1 and head on Red 1, and then we head south. Cool. In any case. So, hmm. Yep. Friggin' Petey. I... I may have to do a kind of play test. In other words, it might, it might be a while before you see another High School Dreams video. I don't want that, you know? I'm hoping I can figure this out by next week. That would be nice. Blinkers are for fools. Oh my god, no car, what are you doing? Freaking truck? See, the problem with this truck is that it wants to be free, so when it sees an open area, it's like, fuck yeah! And I'm like, no, tr no truck. There, there are, there are invisible walls. They don't want you to be free. Like, no. But I want to be free. All right, move. Move. Get, get out of here, man. Fucking assholes. In any case, um, this isn't an American thing, by the way. Uh, just so you know, if you are one of my brothers from another mother in. Uh, the European states, then you should know that this this isn't how Americans drive. I, I just drive like this because I'm from Maryland. This is how people from Maryland drive. <laughs> In any case, let's see. Um, <clears throat> got a call from my uh, quasi brother, little Mike. Mike, if you're out there, hang in there, man. Give me a call. Oh, and uh, Loki says she wants that Volvo. I agree. I can't get her on Skype. She she doesn't like talking to people. I got experience, yo. Awesome. And from the sound of my tablet, I also have mail. It's probably from Steam telling me how awesome a driver I am. I believe it. Like smooth. Yeah, Volvo is ba basically the uh, the brokenest trucks that you can buy in this game. Get a Volvo. Now don't don't buy anything first. I started with a Majestic. Trust me. Get a Volvo. Volvo make the best uh, lorries. I think you guys call them. Yeah. Trucks. Also, I am super fast. Oh no! I was caught speeding. Fuck. I'll just have to deal with it with my my running outest th uh, funds. Hang on a sec. All right. <laughs> All right, red one south. We're going to burn. Burn! First you drive, then you burn! Uh, yes, this is the correct way to go. Oh, let me turn that off. That must have been annoying for you guys. Why didn't you say anything? You could have just yelled on the screen. I would have heard you. All right, we got 20 minutes to get to burn, although I suspect it won't take 20 minutes. Uh, my gas looks good. My speed looks better. Driving without a 12-ton weight on my uh, trailers makes this truck very smooth to drive, very easy. Uh, it is somewhat easy on the eyes, but uh, I probably won't, uh, I'm probably won't mention anything about that. I'm, uh, I'm really into this game. It's very calming. Yes, calming is the word that I would use. Out of my way, asshole! So, um, in any case, what else can I talk to you guys about? Because PD... I'm gonna be working on Petey. Don't you worry about it. That's not uh, that's n that's not a, a let's play that I won't finish like a couple of my other let's plays. We we are definitely going to try and finish Petey, even if I have to start over, and redo the whole goddamn game. I shouldn't. I have a um, I have a secondary character I can try and win with her, and then we'll we'll just have to say that Liz and Petey just can't ever get together. Doc appointment. My sister's going to a doctor's? What? Uh, 
have to question her about that. Ooh, 50 more experience points for going 100 kilometers. Awesome. Which is something like 60 miles or something. I'm not sure how fast I'm going in miles. 150 kilometers per hour. That's not much, right? That can't be very high up there. I mean, it's, it's kind of like the exchange rate between Canadian dollars and American dollars. Oh! Hey, uh, good news, if you like Euro Truck Simulator, um, I understand from the news that they are working on an American Truck Simulator. Now, they already have an American Truck Simulator. Yeah, but they also have a Euro Truck Simulator 1 as well, which is terrible. And from what I, from what I understand, American Truck Simulator... Oh, God! Slow down. American Truck Simulator is kind of boring. Because anybody who has driven through America knows this. There's in the middle. There's a lot of nothing. Like there's there's flat. <laughs> I've, growing up in Oklahoma, trust me, I thought I knew what hills were until I moved to Maryland, where there's all these mountains. And uh, in any case, but there there is good stuff to see. Like I, I would love to drive a truck uh, over a bridge over the Grand Canyon. That would be pretty awesome because the Grand Canyon is very gorgeous. Oops. Shit, I'm a pinball. There we go, that was only 17%. And we're back on our wheels. <laughs> Fuck. That happened. I wonder how fast I can go now. I should probably inspect the damage. Yeah, let's go ahead and inspect the damage. 22% damage. Let's see, I got 11% of the engine, that's no good. Chassis is 22%, that's the big one, that'll be fine. But my wheels are fine, and so is my cabin, except not. Visit a service station as soon as possible. Alright, that sounds reasonable. Hmm, I wonder what happens when you reach 100% damage. Do you lose the entire truck? Hope not. Kind of suck. The uh, the truck getting damaged is probably one of the worst things that can happen to your truck because it costs so much money to fix it. But like I said before, I'm rich, so I'm not terribly worried about it. Oop. Engine malfunction. It's okay. We're getting close to burn, and we'll go ahead and fix up there. Let's see, gas is doing good though, assuming there's not a leak in one of my tanks. I have two tanks, they're on either side of the back end of me. So as long as nobody T-bones me, I will be fine. Let's see, what else? Um, hmm. Oh, I started reading uh, Avatar The Last Airbender The Promise, which is excellent. If you guys haven't got a hold of that comic book, I highly recommend it. The Search and the Promise are done, and right now they're working on The Rift, but I have not read The Search or The Rift. Only The Pro- Oh, fuck, I'm going the wrong way. Um, okay, okay. No, no, we can do this. We'll just have to take the European way out, by which I mean the, uh, the UK way out. Oops. Let's back up a little bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. There we go. Alright, this, this will work out. All I have to do is squeeze through... Um, hmm. Don't worry about that. What is it? What make was that? A death? I think we can do this. There we go. Now we just squeeze through here. Well, I'm certainly glad I have 700 horsepower. Otherwise, this would be a lot harder. And I'm looking. Nobody turned left. Well, I think I, I rescued myself from that situation pretty well. And here we go. This should lead to burn? Parha. Praha. Oh, no. No, burn is up ahead. Excellent. So, uh, let's see here. You know, I could do other Let's Plays of this and just do, like, one run a play, and that would be fine. And probably cut it, cut out all the boring parts, so it wouldn't be absolutely terrible. The problem is that, uh, and again, if anybody's played this game, out of my way, peasants, if anybody's played this game, you know, there's a lot of nothing that happens in this game. I'm not worried about it. Like I said, it's kind of a meditation. Ooh, I've discovered a recruitment area. Awesome. Um, but, I don't, I, I kind of 
don't want to bore people. I just want to sit back and talk. Just relax. Yeah, God, there we go. I didn't... Hmm. You guys hear that? Hmm. What's in my imagination? Maybe it's my headphones. Huh. Alright, well, let's see how much this cost. Go and we park. Lovely. Okay, engine only two thousand year or uh, pounds. Transmission not much actually. Chassis is the most at eight thousand. Nineteen thousand total. I can't be doing that a lot. I'm gonna have to make a run. But I won't let you guys uh, get bored through me doing one of these runs. So I'm gonna go gonna go ahead and call it here. I planned for this to be about 30 minutes, but mm, no. No, this is good for a video. And I'll tell you what, if, uh, if you want me to do more of these little talks, just uh, leave a message. Uh, I, I do love comments. And I do read all of the comments, all of them, even though I don't get many, so it's not very hard. Yet, yet, it will be. Um, uh, yeah, that's, that's gonna be it. You guys, just relax. Leave a little message for me down below. Tell me if you like this, if you want me to maybe do a run and just cut out all the boring parts, or just uh, sit back and drive around. I have like 50% of this map that I haven't seen yet. I'm good for it all. And I'm going to play this whether I record or not. Anyway, um, ta-ta. I'll see you guys later.